We introduce to you the False Black Widow, also scientifically named Stetoda. The venom of the Stetoda, containing potent neurotoxins yet less intense than those of the Black Widow, is injected through its fangs, sharp as needles, with surgical precision. The Stetoda shoots its silk at its prey with precision, using this ability to efficiently capture them. This silk is made up of ultra-strong and sticky fibers. As we have seen on previous occasions, these tiny spiders demonstrate a surprising ability to catch prey significantly larger than themselves, defying expectations regarding the size difference. This small hunter resides in our homes, deploying its deadly artistry in the Veil of Shadows. This other spider, with its peculiar appearance, is known as Listicus bufo, commonly called crab spiders. In addition to its unique shape, the Zisticus bufo stands out for its ingenuity and skill at the time of hunting. There are other species of crab spiders that have taken the art of camouflage to new heights, blending into flowers so perfectly that they can stalk their prey without being discovered. In previous encounters, we have had the opportunity to observe how the Zisticus bufo exhibits a voracious appetite, with no restrictions in its choice of prey. We have decided to arrange an encounter between both spiders, to be able to observe their great skills. In slow motion, we can observe how the crab spider turns to look at the stetoda, just upon sensing its presence, and then catches it in a perfect ambush. The Zisticus bufo employs a cunning tactic, attacking by surprise from behind to neutralize any defense of its prey, a strategy we have seen it successfully apply on multiple occasions. In the realm of spiders, Eating each other is a natural and common behavior, reflecting their survival instinct. For them, there is no distinction between eating another spider or a fly both are simply sources of food. This dietary pragmatism underscores the reality of their world, where the priority is the survival of their own species and the efficiency in prey capture. The feast provided by the Stetoda will last for several days, nourishing the crab spider, and ensuring the survival of its offspring. We conclude the encounter and allow the Zisticus bufo to feed in peace. If you liked this video, please give it a like and subscribe to continue watching this content.